Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, so today, I want to go over rules and why they are extremely important to have in order to succeed when it comes to your trading. So essentially for rules, what they are necessary and what they are used for is to inhibit our bad behaviors or inhibit and remind us of things that don't work and also remind us of what does work. For example, um, and you can print out your rules, you can write them in your journal. Um, I do both, I have them in my trading journal and I have them uh, printed out so I can visually see them when I'm trading. So I have my trading rules here. You can see with the glare really quickly. So. Um, like I mentioned earlier, when it comes to your trading rules, you want to use them to inhibit any bad habits or any bad behavior that you may exhibit. So for example, during my trading career, um, what messed me up the most was trading in bed and trading in tired. Uh, sorry, trading tired. So when I first started trading, I would literally like wake up at 9.25 and then take a trade at 9.30. And then I'll be wondering like, why am I not succeeding in my trading? It's like, well, you're half awake. You don't know what's going on. You're not prepared. You're in bed. Like you're not looking at all the time frames. A lot of other things. So my first rule is do not trade while tired. My second rule, do not trade in bed. Um, so with the rules that I have for myself, they're gonna inhibit my negative behavior or my, my bad habits. That way I don't, you know, I no longer continue to um, act on them and remind myself, hey Desi, this is what works, this is what doesn't work. Now, the rules are gonna be personalized to yourself and your own trading journey. Like, you know, some people trade in bed and they succeed, shout out to them, doesn't work for me. So your rule list is going to be personalized for you. Another one that I'll share with you is uh, I don't trade the first 15 minutes of the market. For some people it works, for me it does not. And that's okay. Like I said, this is, every journey is personal um, and it's great to understand that. It's okay to have rules that other people may not have and do things that, pe that other people don't do if it helps you succeed. Now, you also want to write down rules that remind you of what does work. So for me, for example, uh, my third rule is trade only your A plus setups, which are reversals, specifically off broader information. Those are my highest uh, percentage, uh, uh, sorry, my highest win rates when it comes to those type of trades. So some people scalp, some people trade the open, some people uh, trade breakouts, and it works for them. It does not work for me. So I, I stick to what works. And in this case, based on my rules, trading my reversals, especially off broader information, my bread and butter. So that's all I do. I don't scalp, I don't trade breakouts, I don't do none of that. It doesn't work for me, and I'm okay with that. Um, now again, just to reiterate, Rules are going to be one of the foundations that you will need to succeed, and especially when it comes to your trading. So write down your rules, print them out, put them in your trading journal, read them to yourself every single day so it can be absorbed into your subconscious and you can act accordingly when it comes to that.